With Russia not attending the Swiss summit on peace in Ukraine and calling it a waste of time, India decided to not sign the joint communique by saying that only those options acceptable to both parties can lead to abiding peace. Representing India at the two-day summit that concluded on Sunday, Secretary West in the Ministry of External Affairs Pawan Kapoor said that India had joined the summit to explore the way forward to a negotiated settlement of a very complex and pressing issue. According to the communique signed by as many as 80 countries, the territorial integrity of Ukraine should be the basis for any peace agreement to end Russia's war. However, underlining that enduring peace can be achieved only through dialogue and diplomacy, Kapoor said that such a peace requires bringing together all stakeholders and a sincere and practical engagement between the two parties to the conflict. The Indian position of not becoming a signatory to the joint communique was explained by Kapoor in his statement as Moscow, one of the two warring parties, declined to attend the summit in Bergenstock in central Switzerland. The Russia-Ukraine war, which began on February 24th in 2022, is in its third year now with no end in sight.